Myself, Sunanda Gholi. Myself, Prashant Gholi. We are studying B.Tech in Electronics Engineering at Falchon College of Engineering. Our mega project is Content Based Image Retriever. And we are going to show demo for it. Uh, this is the code for the project Content Based Image Retrieval. Now I am going to run it. This is the GI window of our project. Uh, there are four options browse image search load it load database and the clear let's browse the image let's take this image of a car this is the query image and uh, we will be searching this query image in the database i'm clicking on the search option This is the waiting window. Images are basically retrieved uh, by extracting the features like color, shape and texture. The search is completed and the similar retrieved images are displayed on the display window. These are the images. I will show you a demo for another image. Um, by uh, clicking the clear all, the images are cleared. Now I will browse another image. Uh, let's take the image of the dinosaur. The image is open. This is a query image. Now I'll be searching this in the database. This is again the searching window. So uh, the features extracted are color, shape and texture. For the color, the mean of the basic color is taken and uh, the value of the query image and the database images are compared. And uh, by comparing the result, the values with minimum difference are displayed on the search window these are uh, these are the result image i will clear it now it is cleared and i'll press for the another image i open this this is the query image now i, I will search this so next feature is the texture for the texture retrieval we have used sft algorithm sft algorithm actually retrieves the 12 value based on the shape of the image boundary conditions and the gray level of the image uh, it is a 12 valued vector uh, the value of the query image and the database images are compared and uh, the val the minimum difference images are retrieved on the retrieved window the search is completed and here we get the similar images from the database i will clear this i will select another image let's take the image of a rose i will search it in the database it is search Another image for the another feature for compare a comparison we have used a GLCM approach that is gray color co-occurrence level matrix. It is being searched. The search is complete. These are the similar images retrieved from the database. Okay, I will clear it now. Okay. Prior to this application, uh, prior to this uh, project, content based image retrieval, we have also developed an application which can be used in the police department from, for crime investigation. I will show you the demo for this application. This is the code, source code for the application. I will run it now. This is the GUI for application. Uh, this has uh, first we have to select the query image of the fingerprint and then okay. 
this is the database for the fingerprints i will search uh, let's take this image as input i open this and now i will search for this fingerprint in the database it has been searched the features which are compared during the search of the fingerprint is the edge detection method and we have used the can edge detection method the search is completed and the image is retrieved uh, this fingerprint belongs to this person and here are the three options of having the personal academic and criminal record of this person clicking on the personal record his personal record is displayed here his name is saurabh he is from mathiran his age is 28 years okay his academic information is follows his criminal record he has charged for traveling with a fake passport and he is a suspected intruder this is okay now i will browse another image I will search this image. Okay. So, what I was telling that we have used Canny Edge Detection algorithm for scanning the fingerprints. Uh, this is because the Canny is the most efficient edge detection algorithm, and it is it it consumes less time to retrieve. Search is completed, and uh, this fingerprint belongs to this person, and his personal record is. His name is Salman Mirza. He is from Hyderabad. His academic record is he is a bank manager in the Bank of India. His criminal record uh, he he has caught been he was caught in drunk and drive case. That's it. I will show you demo for the another image. I have selected a query image now I will search for this okay, it is being searched this application is very useful in the police department if used for the crime investigation there are a lot many, many applications of CBR which can be implemented we implemented the crime investigation application this is the image of a person whose fingerprint is the query image and his personal information is his name is Abhishek Shivankar and he is from Petnaka his academic record is he is also a bank manager and his uh, crime is he is corrupt and fraud okay that's it from the application Control shift.